Say hi to your dad for me. Yeah. I'm sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. Take care of you two. Yeah. Thank God you're okay. Yeah, Herschel! I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of Atlanta, and, uh, Chet, he got killed. No, you're kidding. Those things you're got joking. him. joking. Dad, I don't know what's going Pull on. my leg. I'm sorry, Sean. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just Whoa, you and your daughter, a... then. Oh, not his daughter. He's a... Good Samaritan. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. What are you trying to do, Herschel? Well, looks like you hurt your Stop leg pretty bad me there. my face. I guess the lead. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. He's gonna check on Maggie. From the popular TV series, The Walking Dead. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. I ain't right. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car, car accident. accident. That's so. Where are you headed? That's before so. the car accident. Home. home. Where's home? I grew up in Macon. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. Nobody. I asked you a question. Shut you up. You said we. That's all. I was just making conversation. House is full up with mine. We'll definitely got another remember that. another family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Yeah, that's not happening. Hey, Dad, so I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. With what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. It, like, this is gross. I don't know why we're it sleeping. It smells out. like... I know what it smells like. Duty. That's right. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty, Pretty far. far. Oh. oh, yeah. Okay. Ew, is he drooling? A gross little girl. That's nasty. I love you, baby. <laughs> Hey, get up. No! Oh! It's a redneck. What an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. Shut There's up, a tractor duck. and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. 
Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Doc, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. I don't... You're a weird lady. I don't trust you with... With my surrogate daughter. What's up, Kenny? Hey there, uh, Kenny. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. <laughs> you would be for Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? No kids. Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. Mm. How's your son? Oh, wait, I don't, I don't care about Duck. Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See ya. Kenny's a good dude. We, we like Kenny here. I'm gonna talk to Clementine. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. No, oh, okay. You'll, you'll talk when you want, I guess. Let's go see what Sean and fucking Duck are up to. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Sean's still working on that fence. What a history teacher. This kid's dumb. They got a door? Where am I going? I gotta talk to Herschel, probably. I have not a clue. Herschel it's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Do I even have to talk to Tyler? Hey there, girls. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? Well, I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. I don't know. Lee's kind of thriving. Wait, what? We'll all be home soon. Okay. Back in a bit. See ya. Okay, Lee. Oh, wait. Do I need to actually go do stuff? Oh, wait. Sean's still I... working on that fence. I don't know. I want to talk hey, to Lee. Him. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that'd sure speed things up. Let's do it. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, 
He doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Oh shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. Well, the kid was you dead. don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... Yeah. That bastard. Poor girl's brains in. Whoa. Uh, I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? I'm not, I'm, uh, yeah. not too close with my family. Oh. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. I'm sorry about your friend. Thanks. I appreciate it, man. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Alright, let's go see. Let's go see what Herschel wants. Can I just, like, magically heal this wound and just start running around? Why can't I walk straight? Partial. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. Shut up! I'm not sure I'd follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh. If there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. This farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife. Uh, not anymore. Uh, I think she's up in Virginia, maybe. Sorry to hear it. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. That's right. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar and fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. Oh! And I'd start checking the attitude, friend. So, he just told me, like, he told me, like, Go! you better be I'll honest. Get my gun. Don't be honest.
I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. That's I can not fix you. Don't worry. That is not true, bro. I'll stitch you up. It, it almost... It almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... Uh... Yeah, you're... fucking not alright. And your dad's hand is clipping through your head now. to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. It, uh, you know, just to be I humble. wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl okay, is ever trapped, kinda, you better hope you're kind of fishing for that, Lee. Or your friends aren't cowards. Please, just go. Oh, only Get out and never come back. Got that ride to make it if you want it. What else, dude? I don't have a car. I'm a convict. Should be in a jumpsuit right now, dude. 